Hello, welcome back to the channel. And I thought I'd just show you some new bits. There's Andrew, look, I'm here today. And uh, while Andrew is busy pace fishing, would you believe, I'm gonna show you um, the new bits. So every month I like to do a little review on new bits for you guys to see it. And this is a nice little launch. We'll start with this one, XL Roller Puller Bush. So if anyone who's using our Roller Puller Bush, they are superb, obviously they make pole fishing nice and easy. The elastic runs through the, yeah, one of the normal ones is here, look, it's got set up. Prevent elastic wear against the bush because the elastic rolls around a little wheel. Ooh, super smooth. Oh, he's, what's going on there? <laughs> Um, yeah, super smooth, so prevents your elastic wear and obviously makes pulling very, very easy. The only downside is, sometimes, sometimes if you're using like 19 hollow, 19 like Jura slip, I think elastic's like that, a bit thicker, then the actual PTFE can be a little bit small. So we've done the XL version and you can get the fattest of elastics through there. The hole in the pole is exactly the same, so... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the hole in the pole is exactly the same size. So if you've already got roller puller bushes in our in your top kits, they'll just pop out and you can put this one in if you are wanting to use thicker elastic. So if you're a 19 hollow user, red hydro, that kind of thing, go through there, no problem. Next up, we've got a nice addition to the ICS Jura method feeder range. We've got a new mini version. Now, Des Ship does loads of method feeder fishing in the summer and he was asking for a little babby feeder so when he's casting up against islands all the time he's not putting too much bait in so we've done this little one in 15 gram and 30 gram and um, in fact let me get another one out just to show you so this is the small our ordinary small jura method and you can see the size difference so a decent chunk smaller and you can imagine that's going to be perfect for like winter use and stuff, but also like I say, when you chuck it put against islands and stuff, that little small size is gonna be perfect. So two sizes, little teeny weeny mold as well to go with it. Won't be a Preston feeder without a mold. Absolutely brilliant. And then finally, you all know I love me paste fishing. And we've got some new soft cad pots in a paste version. Now we've also done them with lids as well. They come with two lids each, well four lids, two pots, four lids in the pack so if you do want to use them as like a big feeding pot you can do but fundamentally these are paste pots they've got a nice big groove in the bottom so you can position them you know right up your top kit if you want to you know if you want it like 18 inches back from your pole tip like a lot of paste anglers do then that's perfect but it's grippy enough to still stay close to the tip if you want to so nice little product there there's the nice new bits i'm going to get on with filming with andrew We'll see you again on the next video.